What is going on guys? It is Fatal Reboot Day, bringing you guys a video. And the topic today, we are an HP Pavilion gaming laptop as always, as you can see here. Now, so what today we're, uh, today's topic is going to be about is how to get more storage on the HP Pavilion. Okay, sadly you're going to have to spend some money if you want more storage. There are a few ways here I'm going to talk about in this video that you can do. And everything's going to be accessed through the little file folder down here. Is the simplest way to do it. Um, you can also type it. And the start menu uh, files, uh, you know, like that. If you, if that's easier for you to uh, find out with the files, the file location is going to typically be at the bottom uh, in the taskbar down there. And you're just going to click on it, and this is going to open up everything in your PC. If you're wanting to know what's on your PC internally, uh, like on your SSD, which it already comes pre, you know, pre-installed into the laptop, that is this PC, and that's going to be your C drive, the Windows C. That's typically what they're named. As you can see below that, it says something else. That what it says is my external drive. Now that's what I named it. You can name it whatever you want. You can name it, you know, literally anything you want. Now it's typically going to have a D beside it for D drive. This is the external drive I'm talking about that you guys can hook up as a portable drive. And you can see that to the right, right here, that's plugged up with a little USB. Um, now these are pretty inexpensive. This is two terabytes to be. Uh, now this is a hard drive, not an SSD, so it is a bit slower. Um, when it comes to certain things, uh, but this is a Toshiba hard drive. It's two terabytes. It's about sixty dollars on Amazon. You probably find it about the same price at Walmart, fifty, sixty dollars. It's not too expensive, and it comes with two terabytes. And two terabytes is probably going to get you quite a bit of ways. Uh, you know, as far as gaming uh, for games and files and stuff like that, you're probably going to not need too much more than that. I myself have a terabyte left over on this one to be exact. So that's one one of your pretty much main number one ways that you can. You can do an internal hard drive. Um, so you can take the one that's in the pavilion out and add you one with a bit more storage. Um, personally, I've never done that. Uh, I do plan to do that for a future video possibly, but at the moment I've never done that. So for now, I recommend you do external. External is also easier because you can jump to and from computer to PC, uh, computer to laptop. So like as for, for, uh, for example, I use a another gaming PC which is what my main setup is for streaming and recording and stuff like that or for you know editing and stuff like that for my videos that I do um, and that's you know for and that and I can just switch it to and from that this right here is a thumb drive so this is another little thing that you can use for extra storage if you just don't have the money really to spend the 60 this is gonna run you about 10 to 15 dollars at Walmart or I mean, office max and, you know other places that you can get it from it's just a little thumb drive, and a lot of people have these and don't even realize it. I, I have like it's probably like four or five of them, and it has about 32 gigs on it. And this just gonna essentially let you, you know, add some just, you know, some videos, maybe some clips if you do editing yourself, YouTube, anything like that. Uh, maybe, uh, you know, any little different kind of files, text documents, whatever you know you might be wanting to save. You can do that, and it's usually gonna pull up as an E drive. Um, and this is going to be for your thumb drive. So this, guys, and there's links down in the description below for all of this, the thumb drive and the uh, Toshiba 2 terabyte. if you guys want to check that out for pricing and ordering. This is a way that you can get more hard, uh, more space, more storage on the HP Pavilion. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. this video. Remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.